Hello, Earth citizens. In this video, I will show you a 10 minute routine for your pelvis, your tailbone, pelvis, hip area. This area can get very tight if you sit for long periods of time. So whether you work at an office or you have a job that requires you to sit on a chair for a long period of time, this area can get very stiff. So I recommend trying this routine to open up your pelvis, lower back, tailbone, hip area. You'll feel some relief. Okay, first prepare a mat on the floor and let's do some rolling back exercise. So a mat is very important because with rolling back, if you do it on hard floor, it can hurt your spine. So make sure you have some cushion to do rolling back exercises. So how you rolling back is you hold the back of your thighs and you roll like this. So you massage your spine. So you want to massage all the way to your neck, down your spine to your tailbone. Let's do 20 times. You can do it at your pace or if you can, please try to follow along with my pace. Ready? Let's start. One. Two. Feel your spine. Three. Four. Five. Six. Make sure you're breathing. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Ten more. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Almost there. Eight. Nine. And 10. That's 20. All right, now lie down. Keep hugging your thighs. Rock side to side. Like you're using your body weight to massage your lower back, your tailbone, hips. Breathe out. Cool. Rock side to side. You can feel your kidneys on your left side, right side, left side, right side. Use your body weight to really push down and massage your lower back. Good, and stop. Now hold your knees like this and make circles. Make circles. Again, use your body weight to push down, massage around your lower back, tailbone, pelvis, hips. Okay, now rotate the other direction. Breathe. Okay, stop. Now, place your feet on the floor. Bring your arms to the side like this, palms facing upward, arms 45 degrees, not too high, not by your side, 45 degrees, so there's space in between your armpits. And now we're gonna do some hip bounces. So first, lift your hip and drop. Really drop, not softly place down, not like this. Drop, so you feel the vibration. You should feel shaking in your tailbone and your buttocks. Let's do 50 times. Ready? Lift. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Really lift. Nine, ten. One, two, three, 
four, lift, five, six, seven, eight, nine, twenty, one, two, three, four, can you feel the vibration? Five, six, seven, eight, nine, 30, you might feel some heat, really lift and drop. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 40, 10 more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 50. Great job, stay here. Feel your tailbone, pelvis, and hips. Focus your attention there and take a deep breath in. Exhale out. Long deep breath in through your nose. Long deep breath out through your mouth. One more time. Long deep breath in through your nose. And long deep breath out through your mouth. Now feel your tailbone, hips, pelvis area. Do you feel some heat? Do you feel tingling? Do you feel some magnetic sensation? Pulsing sensation? Whatever you feel, stay connected to the energy feeling there. We're gonna do some more hip bounces. This time, it's not so much lift and drop. We're gonna do soft taps like this. Like this. Double time, but tapping. And we'll do this 100 times. Okay, so like that. So you're really tapping against the floor using your body weight. 100 times, are you ready? Okay, let's start. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, twenty. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, thirty. Feel your tailbone. One, Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, forty, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, fifty, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, sixty, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, seventy, one, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, eighty, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ninety. Last ten. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and stop. Close your eyes. Take a deep, long breath in through your nose. Imagine breathing all the way into your tailbone. Exhale out, long deep breath out through your mouth, from your tailbone. Again, long deep breath in through your nose. All the way into your tailbone. Exhale out through your mouth, from your tailbone. Now feel your tailbone, hips, pelvis. Do you feel heat? If you do, do you feel more heat than before? Or maybe you feel coldness. Cold energy is stagnant energy leaving your body from that area. Do you feel tingling in your tailbone, hips, pelvis? Do you feel tingling in your whole body? Do you feel magnetic sensation? Do you feel pulsing sensation? 
Good. Stay connected to this energy. Now take a deep breath in through your nose. Drop your knees to the left side. Twist to your right side. Exhale. Feel the stretch in your lower back. Keep breathing in through your nose, exhaling out through your mouth. One more time. Inhale, return, inhale. Exhale, drop your knees to the right side, twist your body to the left. Inhale through your nose. Exhale out through your mouth. One more time, breathe in. Exhale out through your mouth, return. Now stretch your legs out. This time, bring your arms 90 degrees by your side. Breathe in, lift your right leg. Exhale, take it to the left side with your legs straight and twist your body to the right. Feel the stretch in your lower back, tailbone, hips, pelvis. Keep breathing in through your nose. Out through your mouth. Relax your muscles. One more time, breathe in. Exhale, return. Now switch, lift your left leg, breathe in. Exhale, send it to the right side. Look over your left shoulder. Keep your legs straight. Breathe. Ah. Inhale. And return to center. Exhale. Lower your leg. Great. Now to finalize this routine, place your hands on your lower abdomen. We're going to hold a bridge posture for 30 seconds. Touch your bottoms of your feet to the ground. Have about a fist width of space between your knees so your knees are not touching. There's about a fist width of space. Now, on three, you're going to lift your hips like this. And we're gonna hold it for 30 seconds, okay? Don't, not like this, really lift. So you're squeezing from your butt cheeks. You're lifting your lower back, tailbone, Pelvis, this brings a lot of energy to this area to open up any blockage, okay? On the count of three, we're gonna lift and I'm gonna count 30 seconds. So are you ready? One, two, three, lift. One, two, three, four, five, squeeze from your butt, six, seven, eight, Nine, ten, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, twenty, one, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, thirty. Slowly drop. Great job. Straighten your legs again. Gently turn your body to the left side and sit up, please. Now feel your lower back, tailbone, pelvis, and hips. Usually, 
you feel a lot of heat here after doing this exercise, or you may feel a lot of coldness depending on the condition of your hips. If you feel heat, it means a lot of powerful energy was generated and moved in that area. If you feel coldness, it means there was a lot of stagnant old energy here that's releasing out of your body. Whatever you feel, heat, tingling, coldness, magnetism, pulsing, this is all signs of energy moving, energy healing that area. So whatever you feel is great. There's no right or wrong, bad or good. It just is what you feel. So whatever you feel in this area, stay connected to the feeling. You did a great job. And if you feel like there's some more work you need to do in this area, please feel free to rewatch this routine, go through it again. When you go through another 10 minutes of it, you'll feel even greater benefits. To experience a full one hour brain education based class, please visit a local body and brain yoga studio near you. If you don't live near a body and brain yoga studio, please consider online memberships through Brain Education TV's YouTube channel. Thank you so much. I'll see you next time.